What's up, guys? You know who it is. <laughs> Marcus, man. With another episode of Rise and Grind. Yeah. <laughs> hey, listen. I'm going to jump right into it. So, ways to maximize fat loss. Okay? Ways to, tools to max, blah, blah, blah. Three things that you can use right now, right now, okay? Three things that you can use right now to start burning fat, maximizing fat loss, okay? Uh, there's one. It's one thing to lose weight, right? But the other thing is losing fat, okay? And you want to focus on the fat simply because, right? You see a lot of people they will they'll go on this huge weight loss transformation, and they have like a fuckload of loose skin and you're like oh man you know you're you know if you are the one that losing the weight and you're like golly you know i did all this hard work you know but i got all this loose skin going that's because the fat cells have stretched out and they have um you know it's not sometimes it's not a lot you can do about it but um the, the way that you can minimize the loose skin right is to focus on losing the fat all right so how do we do that, Marcus? All right, what's the three tools that we can use to focus on burning fat? All right, well, cool. I'm glad you asked, okay? I'm glad you asked because you know what? I'm going to tell you. <laughs> and shout out to the DSD Army. Thank you for the questions, guys. I really, really appreciate it, okay? And one of the questions was, how could I... Um, I mentioned something about macros in one of my sessions and uh, on one of my Go Lives as well. And the question that came back was, well, well, how do we track our macros? You know, our proteins, carbs, fats, sugars, you know, sodiums and all that, right? So I was like, okay, you know, yeah, I will I will do a go live on that. And I also, um, was go I'm going to follow up with this as well. So if you guys are watching and you're in the DSD Army, hey, this is a freebie. <laughs> okay, look, first thing, my fitness pal. Okay, one of the things that I use is my fitness pal. Okay, so those of you that are in the DSD Army, you know that already because I have you on my fitness pal. There are some other apps that I use, but I'm not gonna tell you all my secrets. Golly, shoot! <laughs> so I use uh, my fitness pal. Okay, my fitness pal will allow you to make uh you can set up your whole profile on there right you can put in how much you weigh you can put in your target weight you can put in um you know how many calories you want to intake i mean it's very very user friendly okay so it's going to ask you what's your lifestyle like do you sit down most of the day are you active most of the day are you very very active most of the day like they have like uh sedentary jobs salesman jobs um you know, like maybe a postman or mailman, something like that. So you put in and it, you put in your information and it gives you how many calories. It is about 90 percent accurate. Now, I will I will fluctuate a little bit with the calories and uh, with the proteins and so on and so forth, simply because uh, if I work out a couple times a day, because now now that I pull my hamstring, I do a lot more um, uh, resistance like. You know what I'm saying? Push-ups, sit-ups, stuff like that. Because my hamstring, I, I can't do my um, HIIT training, right? Well, I will be able to do my HIIT training very soon because I've been heating and icing this old hamstring. So um, once I get that back going, I'll be able to do my HIIT, you know, and I'll start losing weight a lot faster. But, um, you know, it'll, it'll get you to where you can lose up to a, a pound a week, two pounds a week, and so on and so forth. And it'll tell you exactly where... Um, you know, the exact date or what month, the date, the whole nine yards on when you should be, you know, from 225 to 215. Like it'll give you, hey, you'll lose this much by November 15th or whatever, right? So it's cool. So make sure you go in, check out my fitness pal and use that. That's the number one tool, okay? Number two, you need a cardio plan, okay? You need a cardio plan. Here's, here's why, okay? So you need a cardio plan so you can, so you can have some 
some room to play. All right. So a lot of times, you know, you'll hear a lot of guys and a lot of trainers say, even I have said, hey, you know, um, weight training trumps all. Yes. I, and I still believe that. But cardio will give you, let's say you do cardio and you burn 30, 300 calories. You got 300 calories now. You have 300 tangible calories is what I like to call them. OK, that you can use in order to play with. You know what I'm saying? So if you want to, you know, if you're feeling a little hungry and you want to get that little snack and the snack is only 100 calories, it's not going to hurt you. You see what I'm saying? Because you did your, you know, you did your 30, 300 calories burned of, cal of, uh, of cardio. So that's why I'm a, I'm a big proponent of having a cardio plan, right? So that's why I say, hey, get, get in the 90 mile challenge. That'll help you, you know, burn some extra calories. All right. That's, that's the main thing that I use cardio for. And like I said, unless I'm doing HIIT training, right? So I can maximize fat loss. But if you want to, if you want to be flexible in your, in your, your calories and in your macros, you want to get your um, cardio in, you know, try to burn at least 300 calories, at least 300 calories. All right. Um, so definitely want a cardio plan. That's number two. Number three, the number three thing that you want is a resistance program. A weight training program um, that's it weight weight training or resistance training you want to have some kind of weighted resistance even if you're just using your body weight right if you're just using your body weight push-ups is good um, sit-ups is good you can do elevated push-ups um, you know you can do decline sit-ups I mean there's a lot of ways that you can use your own body for resistance training Push-ups is excellent. I mean, push-ups is very, very, um, it's, it's, it works a, a various amount of muscles. It's got shoulders involved, chest involved, back involved, biceps, triceps, forearms. I mean, a whole upper body workout and you're holding the core nice and tight. So you're working abs as well while you're doing push-ups. So um, with that being said, what else? Oh, weight training. So if you, if you have access to a gym, I know it's a, a lot of us have apartment gyms. A lot of us are members and we have, you know, uh, gym memberships and so on and so forth. Lift weights. OK, the number one exercise that I would recommend is do deadlifts. Right. Squats and bench press, whether it be um, you can do incline bench press, you can do um, flat bench press, decline bench press. It, this is all going to maximize actual fat loss. Remember, I said it's one thing to lose weight, right? But there's another thing to maximize fat loss. It's a to two totally different things, okay? So if you want to maintain that nice, tight look, you want to make sure you got the resistance training involved and your weight training has to be involved. You have to have a, a program, a weight training program or a resistance training program, whatever it is, whether it be push-ups or you have access to a gym, use it use it i'm telling you you will thank yourself for it later all right so <clears throat> that's it i'm not gonna hold y'all too long in this video see you know what i'm saying i'm out here in the elements and i beat the sun once again what's going on son this is like the second time in a row i done beat you it's it's peeking up over there <laughs> so um listen if you're new to the channel make sure you subscribe every day i have a video packed with a bunch of information um Make sure you also take a look at my uh, 90 Day Blitz videos. 90 Day Blitz is still going down. That's why I give a lot of business information as well. Um, but hey, I can't promise you a lot and I won't. I won't promise you that every single thing is going to work exactly how you like it. Can't promise you that. And I won't promise you that. But I guarantee you, if you don't do something different, nothing will ever change, people. Y'all take it easy and try not to do too much. Peace.